Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make the CSS property text overflow ellipsis work on your HTML element. So we're going to cover why text overflow ellipsis isn't working and how to fix it. Here I have my div element in a basic HTML page and also I have my CSS for ID box specified here. The first thing you want to do is add overflow hidden and text overflow ellipsis. But as you can see, if you run that, the ellipsis is still not showing up. Now it's still not working because another property required to display the ellipsis is missing. And that's white space set to the value no wrap. Now I'm going to save this file and refresh. And as you can see, the ellipsis is showing this time. Now I'm going to adjust the box and as you can see, it's still working. Now remember that the divs display property is set to block by default and this is why it's working for the div, but it might not work for the span tag. So we're going to take a look at how to make it work for the span next. So I'm going to replace div with span here. And as you can see, if I refresh the browser, the ellipsis effect goes away. Now the span does not really need a height. So I'm going to go ahead and remove the height from our CSS definition. By default, the span tags display property is set to inline and the text ellipsis just does not work with inline display. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to specify inline dash block for our span element. So I'm going to go ahead and type inline dash block. And if I refresh the browser now, you will see that text ellipsis has been integrated into the span. So basically, these are the solutions for fixing text overflow ellipsis when it's not working for div and span HTML elements.